Hey guys, Team AJ, H1 for TJ, coming back with another DieCast review. Today we're taking a look at Kerry Earnhardt's 2004 number 33 Bass Pro Shops Tracker Boat Chevrolet that he raced for Richard Childress. Let's take a look at the box. You got your nice Tracker Boats Bass Pro Shops 33 Kerry Earnhardt Action Racing Collectibles RCR. So that says pretty much the same thing, pretty much the same thing. Action, and here's your sticker. In the ARC version, you have 4,000 pieces. In QVC, you have one of 288, making a total production of 4,836. So let's move on to the car itself. Carrie Earnhardt raced this car at Talladega back in 2004 in only one of like the two starts he had in this car. No, he raced this car, and then he raced a Happy Father's Day car, the gold 33 Bass Pro Shops tracker car. So he got this one, and then he's got the Happy Father's Day car. I don't know if both of those are in the same season. I'm pretty sure they are. I could be wrong. But let's take a look from the front of the car. Got Monte Carlo 33, Richard Childress Racing. Bass Pro Shops and Chevrolet here on the hood. Going down side, you got contingency sponsors. You got your Goodyear tires. 33, you got the uh, Outdoor Rewards card. You got Rocky Shoes and Boots. Coleman, Gore-Tex brands, Redhead, and Remington, all before the rear wheel. Got Tracker Boats and Mercury going down the side of the car. Nothing on the quarter panel. C-Push, got Bass Pro Shops. B-Post, you have API Outdoors, Uncle Barks, Beef Jerky, and CVA, whatever that is. And you got Carrie Earnhardt's signature, the RCR logo. Or not the logo, but it says RCR. I'm not sure what else it says. And the American flag. Here on the back, you have Bass Pro Shops Tracker Boats, Okuma, and 33. Remington Arms on the deck lid, no DIN number. So before they started doing that, and this side is the same as the other side. Roof flaps do work, if I can get them open. No, way, actually didn't, oh, whoops. My mistake, false alarm, they don't work. But let's take a look under the trunk. Uh, there's your fuel cell. This was, I forgot this was before the roof flaps. Right here I am like, oh look, they work! And now they don't, and then they don't, so, whoops, my bad. Nothing on the hood, and there's your engine detail. Bomb in the car, pretty cool, I guess. Pretty nice looking paint scheme. Uh, with all those, with, the, with as many contingencies as the car has, and with all these sponsors, it makes the car look a bit cluttered. Um... But overall, it's a very nice car. Le limited camo on it. I like that. I like that they put... Uh, I like the black base with just the camo on the bottom. And you have that stripe going through it, separating the black from the camo. Makes for a pretty good looking race car. Uh, yeah, 33 in 2004 ran at the 500 with Mike Skinner. And then Kerry Earnhardt drove this car at Talladega. Um, then, like I said, he drove the Happy Father's Day car, and then I don't know if he ran this car at the first or second Talladega race, or if he just ran this car at both Talladega races, or if he ran any other car, any other tracks besides just the two Talladega races. Um, so yeah, if you want this car, uh, pretty easy to find it was for me, uh, although anecdotal evidence is not evidence, let us remember that. So... Yeah, I guess that's about all I have to say with this car. I'm not going to make some elongated speech out of a Carrie Earnhardt car. Uh, Carrie Earnhardt's known for looking more like his dad than he is for his driving career. So, this is your uh, nugget for the day. Uh, this has been another review. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video.